A historical neighborhood store in Southeast Brainerd named Inwards Grocery is closing at the end of the month. Our Logan Gay talked with the owner about the impact his store has made on the community. If you live in Southeast Brainerd, then you have most likely shopped at Inwards Grocery Store. The store has been a landmark since the early 1920s. It's been here a long time and uh, I have a lot of charge accounts. I've helped out a lot of people. Being born and raised in Brainerd, Ron Inwards never thought that he would be the proud owner of the historical grocery store. Never thought that would ever happen, you know, just was never in my mind that, you know, I would ever own a little neighborhood grocery store. And Ron Inward remembers fondly when he himself used to visit the grocery store when he was a child at Harrison Elementary. If I had a nickel or dime in my pocket, I had to stop in here and, and a lot of candy was like uh, two for a penny. After nearly 35 years of providing groceries to the surrounding communities, he and his wife have decided to retire and close the store. The kids in the neighborhood are very mad at me for uh, quitting and they wanted to know if I had kids or anything that could uh, take over the store, but uh, I have two sons and neither one of them are interested in, in the store. Times have changed and there are not very many neighborhood grocery stores left. I'm the last of the little guys in town. Uh, people just don't uh, use the little stores like they used to. They just soon save a quarter and drive across town or whatever. Or there's Walmart or Costco or all those places nowadays. So we're just here for your convenience. So. The store will be officially closed when all of the merchandise is sold. In Brainerd, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. The Inwards are not planning to sell the store since they are still planning to live in the home that is attached to it. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.